So right now we are looking at XUS1 Pro electric skateboard in traffic versus a car. So in the top right corner there's a video feed from the car. Both is using the same road but not at the same time. So right now we are passing through heavy traffic with the XUS1 Pro. As you can see no problem. The acceleration and braking on the XUM Pro is very very smooth so I am very confident using this spot in traffic but of course you have to be careful so right now we are on a not so smooth road but I'm using the Riot version of the XUM S1 Pro so it helps reduce the road vibrations like maybe around 30% less so right now we make a turn as you can see on the video feed of the car we haven't made a turn yet, now we are making a turn, okay. So right now the XUS1 Pro is leading. So as you can see I am following the back of a white Alza here. Make sure that you stay safe behind other car. Make sure that you don't follow too closely otherwise you can't do emergency brakes so right now I'm cruising behind the car maybe at around 30 km an hour just following this car not gonna do something crazy to like try to cut off a car or something but just following behind the car safely as you can see on the video feed of the car we are still behind the SUS1 Pro is leading despite of the not so heavy traffic so right now we are following the white Alza still right now maybe our speed is around 40 km an hour plus so with X1 Pro you can actually go very fast without speed wobbles because the setup of the X1 Pro it uses stiff deck so that's the advantage of stiff deck and the downhill seismic trucks that it use it keeps the board very stable as you can see I'm speeding above 45 km an hour now without a problem so that's it, that's the end of our commute here, maybe around 1 plus kilometer, 2 kilometer plus and we are done with the X1 Pro and as you can see the car is not yet there, maybe around 2 minutes late or 1 minute late but the time that I take the video footage of this car it is not so heavy of traffic but still the car reaches around 2 minutes late so that's it that proves that electric skateboard is very convenient on last mile commuting